What is up everybody, Madcap here, and welcome back to more Freelancer. In the last episode, we were on the run from Rhineland. They were attacking us quite a bit along our route. Um, and we made it to this station, which is Shinkaku, right? Yeah, Shinkaku Station, um, where we're supposed to meet somebody in the bar. Uh, Quintain had a contact there, so... That's where we're at. I don't know if he was successful in making the contact, but we need to go back to space to meet him and see what he has to say. Uh, this is a decently active bar. Look at all these guys in here. With all their secret information. Tower 29 was okay. Let's get out of here. Let's go do this mission. I'm ready. Fully stocked and loaded. Ready to go. Freelancer. What do you got for me, guys? Come on. Come on. You are cleared for launch. Good luck out there. Thank you, Shikaku. Guess what? There actually was a message for Quintain. Apparently, the crest base is not far. It's in a secret location on the far side of this system. The bartender gave me a set of coordinates. I'm uploading them now. My friends, I will take my leave from you now. Copy that. There is indeed a war coming between Rhineland and Bretonia. I am needed at home. I understand. Thank you for everything, Tobias. We will meet again, I promise. Trent, get these people to safety, and find out what this artifact of yours is all about. Good luck to all of you. All right, everybody. Let's get moving. Thank you, Tobias. I appreciate all the help. All right. Let's do it. We are going straight this away. God, did I already mention how beautiful this place is? Man, I couldn't imagine living on a planet that was kind of in this type of area. And you look up and it's just like we all these careful. crazy colors. The bartender warned me that Rhineland ships have been sighted in the area. He suggested that we fly through the methane field. It should mask our engine signatures. Okay. What did the bartender say about Cress? Not much. He told me that Cress frequently operates in this area and then he gave me these coordinates. That's all. Unfortunately, the field will only provide us with cover for half of the way. After that, we'll have to fly through open space. Great. Methane fields and open space. Fantastic. It's alright. As long as we survive the methane fields, I'm sure we can survive anything, right? I like to build up music. We're at the edge of the field. From now on... We're without cover. Here we go. So far, radar is clear. Oh my god. <laughs> Looks like the whole damn Rhineland fleet. This is the Rhineland battleship Shore. Yeah. Cut your engines and deactivate your weapon system. This is about Prepare to get to be real hard. We can't win this. Trent? Real. I'm picking up new contacts. Freaking Coming hard. Very fast. Professor Quintain, Colonel Crest sent us to help you. Yeah. Crest. How did you know? No time to explain. We're uploading coordinates. Professor, you and the freighter have to fly there as quickly as you can. We'll try to hold off the Rhineland fleet. God, those ships to are all cool. ships, we have unidentified targets on an intercept course. All fighter wings, break and attack. Moving to intercept. <sighs> this is Razor Leader. Concentrate your fire on the heavy cruiser. Roger that. We're locked on. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo. Red alert. The shitter is hit. Man all of the fighters engage enemy ships. Incoming! <laughs> Quintain escorts. We can use your help. Engage the Rhineland ships. We have to buy the professor time to get away. Can do. This is where it gets fucking hard. Balls hard. Okay. Um. Christ. 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 Okay, this is where I actually will start doing this. Okay, there's no plan for this, by the way. I always suck bad at this. But if you link your mines to your guns, you can kind of lay a minefield behind you as you're flying around by just shooting. Um, it's not terribly useful, but it's a little bit of extra damage you might be able to get. Alright, I am going back here for a second. I need to regain my bearings. Okay, there's one down. I heard the little pring! Okay, where do we want to go? Gunboat. We can go for the gunboat, right? 
Come on, get over here. I can take out a gunboat. Yes, go into the field. This is perfect. I accept this. Halfway down, gotta recharge my guns. That's fine. Are you actually slow enough for me to get one of these? I very much doubt it. Poor torpedo. It's trying. Man, it ain't the fighters that are killing me. It's just the heavy ass barrage of huge ships. Okay, that's gunboat down. The hold is buckling and giving way. We're losing integrity. Uh. Whoops. Oh my god. I whew, I was too busy listening to that guy's dialogue. I almost got myself killed. Okay, what's next? Here's another gunboat. He's almost halfway down already. That's good. Except he's leading me back into the heavy cruiser. And the battleship. There's some fighters left. Okay, good. You're down. I'd love it if somebody could blow up and give me a shield battery. That would be great. Oh, thank you! Okay. Here is precisely why I picked up the torpedo launcher. This is exactly why. I knew this was coming. <laughs> Thank God I got all the other stuff down. They can handle the fighters. I think I'm in range. I'm not actually sure. Let's do this a little bit more fancy, like. Yeah. Don't do it fancy, like, because they go. <laughs> they go to shit on you. Okay, those are slow. I am going to go in. And if you want to have some fun, this is where you can- oh my god, don't kill me please. This is where you can do this, and then target some of the points, like the defense turrets. If you were so inclined. I am not that so inclined. Yeah, they weren't close enough. And you can just have some fun here. Don't- don't strafe while using torpedoes though. That is not good. Okay, I've had enough fun. You get my ass kicked. Didn't you learn from the first episode? Don't fuck around. That's how you get yourself killed. I think we're close enough from here. Shit, I just want all these goddamn guns to start targeting me. Alright, I'm going down here slightly. Get me around those guns. And from the back. Oh, I'm sorry, battleship. Did I just kill you with my fucking torpedoes? <laughs> Now we can handle this. Ah, uh, I've had worse than six on whatever. I don't have any shield batteries though. Ah, you fucking bastard! Yeah, get those stealth blades off me. Man, this guy loves to just jumble me around. Whether it's a mine or running right into me. We don't need the tadpoles anymore shooting off. It's not much of a trick, but it is a, a nice trick. That way you're always laying mines. So, I don't know. Just something to, to make note of, if you were so inclined. But that's that's generally why I take the mine launcher. I don't use it. But when you're in huge fights, namely this one, um, it could just give you that little bit of an extra edge of free damage. Especially if people are following you around. Or if there's big ships that are really slow, so you can probably fly by the battleship and just drop thousands of mines as you're traveling around. Um... And get some easy damage that way without overheating your weapons. We made it. We're at oh, the yes! Excellent. All fighters, disengage and return home. I can't believe I did that first try. I honestly can't believe I did that first try. That is one of the hardest parts in the game, generally. From what I remember from like 87 years ago playing the game. I remember having to hide by the asteroid fields. And like peeking out and shooting and then coming back. Um, maybe it's because, I, I mean, I didn't know when it was coming, but I knew this part was coming up. So I kind of stockpiled a little bit with my star killers and whatnot. So maybe that helped a little bit. I don't know. But yay! I thought it was over. It, me How too, Junie. The bartender on Chicago contacted us. Chris immediately sent us to find you. Rhineland ships have been spotted in this system for several days now. When we heard that Quintain was on Shinkaku, we knew he'd likely run into trouble. <laughs> we were getting worried. 
We should be safe now, but we need to keep moving. The jump hole to Tau 23 is near. Trent, I've uploaded the coordinates. Let's go. Be careful in the methane field. Certain pockets are explosive and could damage our ships. Yep. Methane field. Woo! Ah, don't try this at home, kids. Methane field. Yep. <laughs> sure enough. As long as I don't fly into any one of them. They can explode around me, but... I don't want to fly directly into one. Although now that I said that, I'm kind of tempted to try just for fun. Sorry, we're at Tau 23 already, though? Are you taking us to Cress? No. Yes, Colonel Cress is currently a guest of the Outcasts. He'll be pleased to see the you, who? Professor. There's the jump hole. You son of a bitch, you're leading me to the Outcast? Do you not know how much trouble those guys caused me in my in-between video recording? <sighs> the outcast. Great. Just great. I probably killed like 50, 60 of them in between videos. It's not far from here to the base. I'm uploading the coordinates. Where are we? We're in Tau 23. Not too many people know about huh. this system. It's fully within the barrier. Both BMM and IMG are maintaining bases here, since rich deposits of beryllium and niobium have been found. I was here. I don't know if I saw a Cali base, though. Trent, we have to go I know, I'm sorry, my engines are charging. And this is the system that had the radiation icon the whole time. Now I remember. Radiation alert! Radiation alert! Whip, 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 whip! Whip, 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 whip! Cali base. It's almost like we're back in Liberty now. Ah, good old Liberty. Home sweet home. All oh, those stupid traitors. I only have 19 tadpole mines left. Wow. I, mm, I don't know if I'll be re rejuvenating those. Resupplying. ships. Identify yourselves. This is Freelancer Alpha 1-1. One one. We're bringing a visitor to Colonel Cress. We're expected. Razor 1, your party is cleared to land. Professor, land on the base. Cress is awaiting your arrival. I like... I like... What is he? Cress Razor 1? I like how it's like, We're expected. Shut up, motherfucker. Doc. Roger that. Your request to Doc is granted. Oh my god, what the hell's wrong with her? Was that like a lip ring, an afro, and green hair or something? That guy's a pistol. Juni, maybe you and Sinclair should stay with the ships. Quiet. Just need to find Cress. Uh, quiet! State your business. <laughs> My name is Quintain. I'm here to see Cress. Colonel Cress sees no one. He'll see me. He sees no one. Don't go and do that. Uh. Now that I've got your attention, take us to see the Colonel. I think, my friend, you misunderstand your position. I'm expendable. Uh, damn. A little cocky little smile. Cress. I'm that is pleased to see that you're right after all. And you brought protection. Very wise. Please tell him to stand down. Mr. Trent. <laughs> Come, Dr. Quintain. We have much to talk about. That guy's one hell of a bouncer. Let me offer you the sanctuary of my base. Thank you. We'll need a place to continue our research. We I just want a sidewinder at your fang. disposal, of course. As long as you got sidewinder fangs, we've we're good. had our eye on Dr. Quintain and his research for quite some time. When Dr. Sinclair made her discovery, it caused quite a stir among our enemies. What enemies? The Rhinelanders? Let's just say that your enemies are our enemies. No, Give my enemies are answer. outcasts. Who do you work for, Colonel? The Order. The Order. Work for Aurelian. Despite what you may have heard, we are only interested in freedom and peace. If that's so, then why all of the attacks? <laughs> I understand your suspicion, but we are not guilty of nearly as much as your media would suggest. For now, please accept my hospitality and the spirit in which it is offered. Tell me, what else do you require of me? What if I'm right? There's something we've overlooked. We need the Proteus Tome. What's that? 
It's a piece of parchment that rests in the Natural History Museum in Kasari. I think it holds the answer to the artifact. It's kept in a sealed titanium cylinder in the archives. Very well. That shouldn't be difficult. We have an agent in Kusari who may be useful for this. Lord Hakira. He's a local potentate. He can arrange for its liberation. No dice, Crash. I'm going myself. You don't really <laughs> trust me, do you, Mr. Trent? <laughs> I no. don't. But if, as you say, your enemies are our enemies, you won't deny me this. Or me. If you're going, I'm going. Or me! Wait, I am Trent. Damn, I just wanted to get in on the action. Yeah, I don't trust that guy either. Not that I'm foreshadowing to anything, I'm just Prepare, playing along complete. with the game. So don't go thinking I'm trying to spoil the game for you. Uh, Dragoon 12631. 12631 out of 303. That's a weird firing rate. Hmm. That's not bad, though. I don't know. I'm pretty much fine with what I have. I am so low on money, it doesn't even matter anymore. Can't afford anything anyways. Uh, I hope I can afford these. Loaded. Yay, I got 14. I, save I have some crap to sell, though. So that should at least get me some of my garbage that I need. I've been spending too much restocking things like torpedoes and crap like that, so... That's why I don't use them. Is that guy wearing an oxygen mask or something? Loaded into cargo hold. Uh, I'll keep the tadpole for now. Pick up some more of you guys. Star killers. I'm not gonna need 34 star killers for anything anytime soon, I don't think. 29.84 for eight. Yeah, I think I'll pass. Thanks though. Okay, let us head out, shall we? Uh, this is save number 40. Hooray. Good. Uh, yeah, I replenished everything, sold everything. Car was empty. All right, let's do it. Freelancer Alpha 1-1. One one. This is Kali. Everything's a go for launch. Good flight. Thank you. Colonel Kress asked me to escort you out of this system. What's your destination? I don't know. We need to get to Kasari space. Yeah, what she said. You're lucky. There's a jump hole nearby that will get you there in no time. Oh, really? Kyushu jump hole. Let's do it. I like when the game opens up to jump holes. It's so much cooler. Look, we all have different ships, too. I still want your ship. What is this, anyways? This is Quintain. Chris Dagger. managed to contact his agent, Lord Hakala. He's waiting for Oops. you on planet Kyushu. Please contact me when you have the Proteus tome. In the meantime, we'll do, Sinclair, I'll continue to study the artifact. Good luck. Thank we'll you, sir. We'll talk to you soon, Professor. See, that's part of the fun, uh, I think, of flying yourself around. It's like I took the risk of looking at a menu while I was flying, and it rammed into an, uh, just like an asteroid. I think that's cool. I could use autopilot, but this jump hole leads directly to Kyushu. Best of luck to you. Thanks, man. Thank you. All right, Trent. Go ahead. Bye, Dagger One. I love you. Doc. We are now going into unknown worlds. Completely different sector, I think. Look at that awesome purple planet. Look at all the stuff to We're shoot. We're in the Oka dust field. We'll head to planet Oso and take the trade lane from there to Kyushu. Certainly is dusty. And if we go out, look at that. We are in Kasari space. Fly to planet Kyushu. I know we have to be going faster, right? Look at all this fucking stuff you can shoot in mine. It's everywhere. My shields are going to be big here. Big here. All this whole flight, aren't they? So cool. Another another beautiful place. Let's take a look around. This is a small field. That's so awesome. A purple Saturn is like the most amazing thing ever. Look at all these little fucking dust streaks going by. Ah, oh. ah, oh. so cool. The binary star system. It looks like. And you got Earth over there for no apparent reason. 
just, just because. What does the map look like here, anyways? Oh, just some minor asteroidage. Funny, I used to fly around this asteroid field when I was younger. You lied. My grandmother lives on Tsushima Station above Aso. I haven't been back here in over a decade. Damn, Junie. You're dating yourself there. You're at least 10 years old. Crap. I think we're going this way? I actually don't know. Uh, yes. Okay, good. Man, it'd be so awesome to just look up into the night sky and see something like this. Out, outside. Uh, we're almost there. Take the trade lane to Kyushu. Planet Aso. How many people around here? So desolate. Is this? Most things here are green. Starting better than Bretonia. Everything's just neutral. Or hostile, for that matter. And now it's so clear out here. Leave the asteroid field behind. Just back to normal space. Not much landmass on Kyushu, is there? Check land and I'll follow you in. Lord Hakuda will be waiting for us in the bar. Copy that. On my way. Roger that. Your, Your request, request to land is granted. Is granted. Proceed, Proceed to, to land. land. Ooh, can't wait to see Kyushu. Oh, we're not going Mr. to get to you. Trent? Miss Zane? I was told you would be coming. I'm Lord Hakira. I am the prefect of Honshu. Is there a problem? I'm sorry, you're just not what I expected. <laughs> you expected a terrorist, then. I served the order to help my people, Mr. Trent. I understand that you are here for the Proteus Tome. Unfortunately, that will not be easy. The artifacts in the museum have come under renewed scrutiny. I will need to secure a special permission for us to be allowed access. Lord Akira. Please excuse me. I've recently lost samurai. contact with one of my operatives. It's like a in space Ryan, samurai. This may be news. Like a space I Marines. will be in touch once I get access to the Proteus Tome. Why can't we have space samurais? That's it. What are we supposed to do now? Wait? Like hell we will. I have contacts here too. But to get to them, we're going to have to split up for a while. What am I supposed to do around here while you're gone? Well, you should try to fit in a little. Maybe get some work. By the sound of things, this may take a while. Don't worry. I won't be far. The Trent's like, God damn it. <laughs> damn. Always leaving me. Mission result. Success! Yeah. All right. Ooh, yes. Finally. Can we get some new ships? Some things that don't suck? Maybe? Probably not. We got the heavy fighter for the, uh, the bounty hunters. The Barracuda. I like the way the Drake looks, though. This is a neat-looking ship. I don't really like light fighters, but this thing looks sweet. The Hawk's not bad. I wish it was a little more pointy. The front's kind of dopey-looking. Other than that, it's not bad. This is not a bad ship, though. It's not the coolest-looking thing ever, but... It's a uh, good ship, and it's far better than this piece of junk that I'm flying. Fucking fishtail here. Um... But I need to find and explore for a battleship. I don't know where to begin for that, though. Um, that's probably what I'm going to do. What is this blue th crap? Interesting. Huh. I wonder if I should try for that. I wonder what kind of weapons they have, too. Let's see here. Sunfury and the Scrambler. Uh, 101 for 20 and a 4 0. 50 25 for an 8 3. That's not bad for an 8 3. Not too bad. Improved countermeasure. Boy, I'm glad I stopped off in that random system. Because they're still on the improved countermeasure. Sentinel Graviton. 22. What am I at? 1720. Ooh. So we have improved Graviton shielding here. Which means I can dump this favor of something else like you yeah 
Yeah, so I'll probably pick that up. It's a class 5. Oh, oh, I can't go up to class 5. Okay, good. That's good to know. Very good indeed. And let's take a look at our missions that we've got here. Just to see what kind of prices we're looking at. 10-5, that's not bad, I guess. That's about what I was running before in Tau 31, I think it was, I believe. You guys have any news? Sabura saw that the system was perfect. Great. Ryan Lewis managed to spread forces. I understand. That guy doesn't have anything, it's just an empty speech bubble. I could pay you to do stuff, but I don't really want to. Um, so yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is end the recording here and then go just explore for hours and hours and hours and see if I can find anything. But uh, I don't know, like this upside down can of food here. It's a big old huge thing of dog food apparently. Or cat food, I guess. I don't know the difference. But yeah, I'm gonna search for a battleship, see if I can find one. I don't know if there is, I don't really remember. Because the battleships usually have the, the cool heavy fighters. So we'll see. I don't know. We'll see what trouble we can get into. And if, as usual, if anything super important or interesting comes up, I'll probably pend it to the end of this episode. Or if I have enough, I'll make another episode. But we shall see. And until that point, uh, hang tight. And uh, explore around if you're playing along. See what you can find. Because this is a brand new system now. And there's lots of stuff to be found. But that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Until then... Stay metal!